Wagner, Wagner. Taino, Good. I don't uh-huh. care if you're an old head or a young buck I'm not the elevator, I'm no come up, nor do I go down Do like brand newbie and slow down, whole click blow pounds Silences, steady, that's no sound So for your block, I Mary go So the Maximilian Must Know, this one's gonna be a little bit different It is a sample shopping episode, but a special edition where we're gonna be looking at a line of fragrances from the House of Scent story. Now, full disclosure before we start, I did get these bottles for free. I have a very good relationship with the owner of the decant shop, and she's going to be selling, she actually is already selling decants of the entire line from Scent Story. So she sent me these four fragrances to, to do a video on. And again, um, decant shop has these fragrances, and you can always get 12% off with coupon code MAX12. Amazing time to, to go there and shop around and get a gift card for someone for the holidays. What a great gift for people who you don't know what to give them. You can simply give them a gift card and you can help them pick out fragrances or they can pick out their own or consult with Adriana who owns the site and she'll help them out as well. So with Scent Story, I was really excited because a lot of reviewers have really seemed to like uh, 24 Gold. And I wanted to get my hands on a bottle of this pretty badly, but the stuff's hard to get in the U.S. Now, the house that makes these 24 fragrances is called Scent Story. And yes, 24 was inspired by the television show. Uh, in the U.S. at least, it used to be on Fox called 24 about Jack Bauer, who was played by Kiefer Sutherland. And um, a little bizarre because Scent Story is, a, I believe, a Middle Eastern company. And you would sort of think that fragrances made for a television show would be generic, not so great fragrances. More on that in a little bit. Now, from the um, Scent Story website, what they say is, quote, For century start or fragrance has been an integral part of many cultures, from the ouds of the Middle East to the seductive creations of French fashion houses. A fragrance delivers much more than just a smell. It is an experience. Uh and one that lasts over time. That's why we believe fragrances are a perfect medium to tell stories. They represent a universal, timeless language that requires no words, no sounds, just beautiful scents. With over a decade of experience working in fine fragrances, embarking on the project of creating a fragrance for 24 fulfilled a long-held ambition to be the creators of an original fragrance product. Naturally, we're avid fans of the 24 TV series, and this passion led us to approach Fox to create 24 The Fragrance. Then we recruited marketing experts to head the design and marketing development with one clear aim, to design and deliver a fragrance product that will delight millions of worldwide fans of the 24 TV series. Most fragrances are based on a brand that appeals to consumers. Brands can come in many forms, fashion, celebrities, cars. 24, the fragrance launched in 2009 is a new collaboration between Scent Story and 20th Century Fox. In 2012, we will launch Gossip Girl and The Mentalist Fragrances, both manufactured under license from Warner Brothers. Now, guys, as I said, I was dubious. Uh, I've seen too many fragrances by the likes of Lady Gaga and 007 and Justin Bieber, and it was hard for me to believe that a fragrance inspired by a television show could have legitimate merit as an artistic fragrance, but boy was I wrong. So we've got these four fragrances here, and um, I like all of them. There's no BS here. These are all going in my rotation right away, but I really want to talk to you today about two. Uh, first off, 24 Gold, which has gotten a ton of YouTube hype. So again, anxious to check this one out, and it is a great, great fragrance. The notes on this are Jasmine, Oud, Gayak Wood at the top, Sandalwood, Cedar, and Star Anise in the middle, and Vanilla, Amber, Ylang Ylang in the base. And to me, this is like a really good clubbing scent. Sort of one million spice bomb with a dash of nice Oud from the from the uh, center, and you've really got 24 gold. The best way I can describe this fragrance is sort of like a, a slice of vanilla cake with incense in it and oud throughout the journey. It lasts forever and it projects really well. I could easily see people paying double for this scent. I, I think it's pretty much niche quality. You know, I've seen some reviews where people have harped on the oud not being authentic or there not being that much oud in it. And you know, it might not be the best oud you're ever gonna come across, um, it's not an Amouage or Montel Oud, but it's far more wearable, I think. And even if it is a little synthetic, at a sub $60 price, which what you can normally find these guys for, uh, that it's it's an unbelievable deal. And a great introduction for people to Oud scents. And you can tell this wasn't one of your every day, let's rush out a scent for celebrity deals. Uh, the Perfume Maze did a good job looking at the industry trends and then taking what uh, what 
does well in the industry and altering it a bit to fit their budget and produce a fragrance that plenty of consumers will be able to afford. This is just a tremendous value. Uh, and if 24 Gold could ever get their distribution, their scent story could ever get their distribution to the point where this scent and these other fragrances were in U.S. department stores and in Sephora's, this would be huge. I mean, I'm sure of that, you know. The Oud really makes 24 Gold and the Dry Down is, is really beautiful amber and vanilla combination that smells way more expensive than it is. Now, the other one that I really like is called 24 Platinum. And that doesn't get as much hype online, but I feel like 24 Platinum is equally as good. There's been comparisons made to 24 Platinum to 1 million, and I totally see them, but I think 24 Platinum is its own fragrance. And the top notes on this are rose, mandarin, orange, and juniper berries. Middle notes are sandalwood, gurjum balsam, and galbanum. And base notes are vanilla, amber, and white musk. And this is, again, absolutely fantastic fragrance. The opening is really floral and fruity. Uh, it kind of reminds me a bit of Fruity Pebble cereal right in the opening. That's how bright the rose is. It could almost be mistaken for something uh, fruit-like. And then underneath is just a gorgeous ambery incense vibe. And, and wow. I mean, you know, these two fragrances, I want to keep harping on. It could be runaway smashes if they were big in big fragrance retailers. And, and they could be Club King scents, you know. If the Spice Bomb in One Million and Angel Men Crowd ever got a hold of these uh I, I think it would be as big as any of those these are fragrances you guys really need to seek out if you already haven't I, it, and also check out the other two as well go dark and the original 24 there's no slouches in the group and of course decan shop right now has all of them online and her store very cheaply uh, very w great prices. You're not going to find them cheaper. Uh, these are a little bit difficult to find in the United States. Normally, you do have to go to eBay, where they're typically priced around $50 to $60 a piece. But, you know, check out Decan Shop and at least get uh, samples of platinum and gold. Another thing I want to mention quickly is that these all have out-of-control sillage. Uh, also longevity and projection. It's almost unprecedented for fragrances in this price range. You know, in the beginning, I wasn't sure if I wanted to do this video because I didn't know whether I could really stand behind fragrances that were inspired by television shows. But um, I can. And uh, there's a reason that I'm doing this video right now. There's also a reason that this is the YouTube uh, sensation that it is. These are genuinely great deals, and these are really good fragrances. Certainly the best of that entertainment genre. If I had to give any advice to Sense Story, who I'm hoping will see this video, is that if they wanted to keep going with the 24 route, I think that's fine. And they want to do the Gossip Girl uh, fragrance, and I forget what the other one I said was. Um, they're doing one other. Oh, The Mentalist. I think that's fine. If that's what they want to do and, and, and they're doing that successfully, great. But I also want to say to them that I really think they could take these, repackage them if they wanted to, not use the 24 uh, sort of angle with the marketing, and just go go out with these and try to get these in stores because these are good enough scents. These will sell huge in the United States. I, I hear they're sort of a big deal overseas, but uh, they need to be a bigger deal here because they're, they're damn good. And you're talking to a guy who this year has smelled, you know, over 200 niche scents. And uh, I know when something is better than what it costs. And this is way better than what it costs. And if you don't believe me, go to decantshop.com and get a couple of samples. And I guarantee me, guarantee you, you'll be emailing me and thanking me. So anyway, that is this week's episode of Sample Shopping. and More of a brand profile of scent story. Uh, again, great, great fragrances. Really all different, but really all appealing and really perfect. Uh, for any kind of weather and perfect to have in your rotation, especially at this time of year. So definitely check them out. Go to decantshop.com, use coupon MAX12, and remember, that will save you 12% throughout the entire year. You don't need to wait for any uh, Black Friday deals or Christmas time deals. That 12% will always be there, uh, MAX12. And uh, next week, we'll be back with another video of just straight up sample shopping. Stay tuned this weekend for a really nice niche review. I promised you a heavy hitter fragrance this weekend and I'm delivering on it. And then stay tuned Friday for part seven of my collection video. We're gonna go through fragrances 150 through 175. Anyway, I wanna thank you all so much for watching. Uh, have a wonderful week. I am Maximilian. G-O-D, you peeping the candy, heat that they hand me. I be in the land, be you with your family.
talking gangster to church you visit You roll a blade in circuits and picnics The underworld, the circuit I live in You keep your biscuit when working with